So I'm Stephanie Miller and I am the Safety and Health Manager for Critical Projects and Waste Operations in Transportation and Logistics. I've been with UCOR for about five years and I've been on um, Amentum affiliated projects and the legacy companies from those uh, for 11 years. So uh, I went to Murray State University for my bachelor's degree, didn't know what I wanted to do still, and ended up going to graduate school for safety and health with an emphasis in industrial hygiene. And uh, URS came and recruited out of Murray State University, so that's how I got connected with URS, and then of course eventually we became um, a mentum. So I, I started out, my first job out of college was at the Hanford site working on the historic B reactor. And then I left DOE for a while and did um, heavy construction in private industry uh, with our power division. Um, so I've worked at a TVA site, uh, worked on a natural gas construction project up in Wisconsin. Um, and then in the middle of winter in Wisconsin, somebody called and asked if I wanted to come here and I said yes. <laughs> so it was an easy decision. Oh, the safety here is second to none. Um, you know, and the culture is what leads us to that result, that outcome. Um, you know, we've spent so much time cultivating a culture of caring and, and you know, a lot of credit to, to the folks who, who live here and who are from here too. I think a lot of that is already ingrained in, um, in the local culture that they bring uh, into the workplace that's, that's so rich and just complements um, the type of outlook that we value here at UCOR. Well, I like to take my kids outdoors, you know, hiking, fishing. Um, I, I do some, some home projects from time to time when I, when I have time, but a lot of my time is spent playing with my kids. Um, so I have two very young kids, they're age four and seven, and so they keep me very busy. I am starting to get into golf more and I really enjoy it. Um, I don't claim to be a golfer, but I, I aspire to be a golfer. I support some volunteer organizations. Um, there's one called Days for Girls. Um, I'm just starting to get into United Way's Women United group as well. Uh, it used to be called Leading Ladies. Um, so I do, I do some community stuff. Uh, I'm about I get into some safety and health organizations too, so, um, and honestly, uh, ever since having kids, I'm, I'm finally at a stage now where I am taking time to sort of rediscover what I enjoy, and so that list is growing all the time.